It's time for a probe and inception. You, we got two autographs. Get ready to pop loose out of this thing. Let's do some randoming. Good luck in the box break. Last name letter box break. W is the best letter with the most biggest values anyway. We got our special letter list here. Not a nut. Each list goes through the random seven times. We stack the list up side by side. Lucky number seven. First random's finished. Hope you pull big at this thing. Lucky number seven. There it is. And Frank G, you scored the letter W. We're looking at uh, just some different letters. B was actually a good one. Bennett is in this, and his stuff goes for big. I know H is pretty good, too. But C and W, by far the best letters, probably. I know W is. Let's go. Let's see what we get. A lot of possibilities, that's for sure, with Bryce Young and C.J. Stroud. Richardson. Is that who I think it is? Oh, man, it's not. It's not. <laughs> I've been wanting to get somebody a Wimbenyama. But, Frank, it is letter W. And it's a parallel. That's a good one to have. Look at that Caleb Williams. Oh, I think we saw a Caleb Williams similar on eBay up near the top of the sold item. So this looks like a really, really good hit to me. You got an autograph, great big jumbo patch relic. Oh my, this looks like a really good one. What's this thing numbered down to? It's like two of five, Frank. Oh, man. Look at that. Wow. Yeah, that's that's like the monsters we were just looking at on eBay, bro. That's a good one, man. <laughs> All right. Frank G. All right. Yeah, that is really cool. I'll flip it right to eBay and you'll see another one. It's number to five, I think, up there for a thousand or something. Something close to that. If you were going to sell it, uh, you could probably get something close to it or, you know, who knows. But it's a, it's a really good, very desirable hit to have out of the product. So 
That's super terrific, man. That's super terrific. Nice going. It is, a t what is it, one of five? Two of five. No, no, one. One of five. Boom. Yes, sir. Ho. Now we have a Drew Alar autograph. I'm just really happy for Frank, man. But also, a big congratulations going to KG. I'm having trouble thinking of who Caleb Williams got drafted by. Anybody want to chime in on that? Who, who did get Caleb Williams? Who's he playing for? Looking for my top loader, too. I want to get that thing right into a protective case. Here we go. Yeah. Nice, man. That's great. It's a big hit right there. All right. Nice Drew Alar. Congratulations. KG picking up a nice one there. So this one is uh, Frank's right here. Oh, no, wait, wait. Yeah, yeah, okay. Howard, yep. Frank G. Boom. You got another one out of the break. And what else is popping out of here in this inception? Another Drew Alar. So you got the base and you got the autograph, K. Okay? KG. Very, very nice. Yeah, there's a lot left to the air of mystery about these players because a lot of them haven't seen any pro time. Now, you could argue that for um, Wimben Yama, because he's, he's got experience playing in France's leagues, and it, it seems like a good preparation for playing in the, in the big major, you know, arenas. So Jackson Dart with the inauguration. Oh, nice one for Arturo there. Jackson Dart. And then our final card out of this box break is 
Gonna go to letter B, that's Casey. Inauguration. Bowman University. Nice hit. This was definitely the hit of the break right here. Let's see if we can click right over here to eBay. I, I, I'm pretty sure we're just looking at one of these up here. I mean, I'm pretty sure. Didn't we spot one of these Caleb Williams? That's been it. I thought we saw Caleb Williams up here just like that one. Maybe I'm mistaken. These are all Wimbyama base rookies. There's a Caleb Williams 101. There's a Caleb Williams 4 of 5. Now that's 4 of 5 without the jersey patch. There's, there's, a, there's, there's some big values in this. We do have another box. It's a fun rip. And you can just see, yeah, there's big values, but I was, sir, all right, so, well, we did see a number to five autograph, but it did not have the relic. Yours has the relic and auto. Uh, let's see if we've got, maybe there's one over here. That's number to 50, sold for 500. So we know it's going to be more than $500, Frank, if you were to sell it. You may not want to sell it, but it's going to be worth way more than 500 bucks. I would be, I mean, I, I would think it'd probably be, if I had to guess, gosh, I think it would be up around, what is that? Okay. Hmm. <laughs> so anybody ready to buy that thing man I mean this is Caleb Williams up here it's number 25 it's a double auto you say 750 I think it might go for more man if you were to put it up in the, in the eBay market I think we're up around a thousand because this is a number to five autograph right here and doesn't even have the relic it's a questionable, it's very debatable, sure. There's a one of one. Where's that where's that one? Okay, this one's number to five. And it's two thousand. That's a really nice looking hit. Hmm. I don't know. I would say at least a thousand dollars if you were to put it on eBay. Just for looking at that. Yeah. I mean, there's no reason why this should not sell for a thousand dollars. In my mind, maybe I'm maybe I'm just yeah. <laughs> good times, man. Thanks for getting in here, friendly collectibles, man. It's just always fun stuff. Congrats. We are on to the next big thing around here. You know, we've always got big stuff going on with some of these breaks. So. This one, we, we hit this one out you, you, last night. We pulled this one of one. And now that's a great one of one. I wonder what this will go for. We've had some good luck around here. Hope. 